And we're at the Array Event Center on the campus of Metro State to bring you Metro State women's basketball against Colorado School of Mines. Sam Russ dumps it down low into Courtney Martin and the junior from Parker, Colorado. You're not wasting a lot of time in possession early on. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we saw this in fast-paced game. Fast break here. Great vision by Payne to find Ordorf open. Career at Metro. Yeah, national signing day being Wednesday. And there's Brittany Curl with a three-pointer of her own. And I'll just mention, just entered the game. Hannah Stepanovich, the other freshman who just entered. She finds a wide open Brittany Curl who's What a great her pass off right there. Courtney Martin's gonna be a big key in this, going into the paint right there. And Janae Payne again allowed to just go right by her defender. I believe it was Helbig that she gets the easy high percentage shot in. And now Helbig comes down the floor and catches Ordorf sleeping. And so 35 to 33, the Ore Diggers in the lead as we go into halftime. The shot doesn't go. Great rebound there by the senior, Denny Jacobs. She crashed the boards perfectly there, came away with it. Tonight, three, four for six right now. Oh, what a job there by Courtney Martin, the junior from Parker, Colorado. Just watch it with us. Eric Lansing, Davey Burke's going to have the call on that one. Should be a fantastic turnover. Brittany Curl, keep giving her the rock. She's hot so far tonight in the lead by one. Brittany Curl, 17 points on the night. And now a steal by Curl and a fast break. Three on nobody. Janae Payne goes up for the easy layup. Bound. And now Tyree puts up the fadeaway jumper. Fantastic job there by Denny Jacobs. Gets it down to Ordor. Cuts down the middle, found the open lane, and up and in. Jessic to her own rebound. And now another three put up. This time, it's by Sam Rusk. Yeah, I thought she, you know, putting her in the starting lineup, it was a matchup issue or without one of our starters, Louisa Tago, was a concussion, sim concussion symptoms. So we thought it was a good matchup for us. And she responded really, really well, you know, shooting the ball well for us. So. It is a tough loss, no question. It, I think it just came down to that was a good game, just making more plays. They just made more plays and than we did, and that's what it, it'll come down to. Um, I think that, like, as a team overall, we just played really well. I mean, yeah, it sucks losing no matter what, and we've been working really hard. We've just kind of been in a slump lately, and I'm not sure what's going to get us out of that. But I think just everybody was hitting it, so then it was making me open. I didn't really do anything special. <laughs>